Hello everybody, my name is Fretex and welcome back to Star Sector and my Robo Madness Let's Play. So they're currently fighting a pirate bounty group as that alarm suggests and there's currently some weird and wonderful ships trying to take us down. Uh, oh, I should be, <laughs> I gotta pay attention to what I'm doing, I'm gonna die. It's fine, they didn't hit me. So this episode I've got a one main goal, which is to get myself up, I think, two levels and we can actually unlock the ability to turn all my ships into AI driven beautiful machines. Now that means there'll be no more humans on my fleet, it's just going to be robots and it's going to be absolutely glorious. Um, let's have a look around quickly. I don't know how it's going to go. These ships, my new frigates, both have broken engines and they're really slow, so <laughs> if we fight anybody that's fast they're going to be completely useless. It's going to be a bit of a disaster. Hey buddy. I love this weapon still. This is definitely my favourite frigate so far. I absolutely adore this super beam cannon that kills everything in sight. It's brilliant. Uh, also, as I'm currently playing Star Sector without any restrictions on ship class, I really want to get myself one of my own destroyers or frigates. Uh, sorry, frigates or... No, destroyers or cruisers. <laughs> Idiot. I got that in the end. Oh, it's got a of Why are there so many missiles? There's so many mi <laughs> What's going on here? Okay, I'm going to just go out on a limb and say this ship is missile based. In fact, is it just missiles? No, no, it's got hammerheads. It's got this massive launcher. It's got a lot of missiles on it, to say the least. I actually don't know if I can kill this by myself. I think I need some backup. If I can get on the back of it, it's doomed. Wait, it just keeps fire. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, it's got a burn drive. Just to point out, because um, I haven't fought most of these ships before, I had to learn what they all do to learn how to fight them. That's so many missiles. Okay, so it's not going great for me so far. Um, I'm dealing with this. My other ships are so slow, they could barely do anything. Oh, everyone's kind of spread out and stuff. Do you reckon we can... I think these guys' speed is like 77 and like 80. It's not a lot. What about this guy here? Fifth, they can catch this ship. If they go over here, they can kill that ship. Uh, the rest of the 1v1s will just have to leave. I can't give them reinforcements. I'm going to have to distract them here. Stay back, missiles! Oh no! I thought the ship was up! Luckily, despite how scary it looks, it's not actually that bad. Is there two of us now? We can do it. With two of us, I think we can win this. Okay, go up. No, don't go to where I am. Go up. <laughs> we need to be separate from each other. I'm going to ignore it. Ignore it. Fight through the pain. Come on. Got it. It's over. Oh, I can still fire. Oh, no. My ally's helping out, though. It's okay. If we get enough damage on the back of it, it's dead. Keep firing, everybody. Ignore the pain. Fight through the pain. Yes. Yes. I got it. Oh, that was a tough ship. If I can capture that... Oh, it's split in half. Okay. Um, I think the chance of us capturing that's quite low. But still, I want that ship. <laughs> if we find one later on, we're taking it with us. So, just like that, though, the enemy has broken. I think my one of my guys is fighting a gremlin somewhere. He seems to have won that one. So, as weird as these ships are, this guy has a pretty big gun, though. It's pretty cool. If it actually hits a, a shot... Oh, that'll work as well. Oh, I will do more damage than that. There you go. It's kind of a gimmick shit. I must have done it. I did it because I thought we called cool try out the big gun. It's not very practical ship design. <laughs> I'm going to have to go through and probably redesign most of these ships at some point anyway. Done. I went pretty well. I don't think we'll be capturing many ships there, but I don't think anyone actually died. No, we're good. That must have great. Ah. Oh. Heavily modify, poorly maintained. Oh, it's a pirate version. <sighs> I'm not sure, guys. I'm not sure. I don't think I would take a story point for a pirate version. But I do want one of these. We will find one at some point. We'll take it with us. Okay, uh, the rest of it, though. Pounds and gremlins. I am not sold, to be honest. We'll just leave that be. Uh, heavy armor mod spec. Cool. <laughs> I'll take it. We got this Lucas as well, which uh, was... Was that what that was firing at me? Limited ammo, 600. I think this is a great frigate killer. Most frigates would be killed by this, I'm pretty sure. 25% shields and armor, but 100% against hull. Oh, so it is pretty effective against some things. 
We take them all. I leveled up once. Perfect. So I'm going towards this fella, which gives us AI ships. Um, let's have a look here. I'm going to go for... There's so many options. So many options. Let's go for this one, the ECM one. The quicker we get this, the more like general advantage we have across the whole battlefield. I love that one. Is there anything I can... Uh, what is this? A kite. I mean, not that exciting, but... <laughs> I'll wait, where's the salvage field? I've been robbed. <laughs> the game's like, no, you will have no things near here whatsoever. Okay, so it seems there's also a big bounty system with a pirate base over there. But at the same time, I don't feel like I'm strong enough to do that. I think I need to get some better weapons and stuff. So I kind of want to fly back to the MVS shipyard. I'm not going to use them exclusively, but at least until we find some cool ships. I think it's a good, pretty good bet. They seem pretty powerful. So we head back there, and we'll see if I can pick up some more friends. And we made it. So let's see. Oh, no. Hey, buddy. Oh, good. They couldn't find anything. I have a problem where I just buy off the black market all the time. <laughs> and it causes issues, everybody. Um, it's, it's a problem. A pro definitely a problem I'm aware of and probably one I would never fix. Okay, luckily for us though, a lot of time passed and so nothing actually bad happened. Let's have a look to see what they have. Armored tanker, interesting. What is this? Universal custom cruiser. Ooh. How fast is it though? 60. No, I want a fast ship. Scout destroyer. Small hybrid, medium, a fighter bay. Oh, it's a point defense fighter bay, not a actual fighter bay. Advanced Chrono Frigate. Now this sounds fun. <laughs> I can't, it's, wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. We got, everyone, hold up. Hold up, everybody. Did you just see that? Look at the bottom. Look at the bottom, mounts. Below that, armaments. Chief phase drone wing. What? It has dr phase drones? Oh, it's going to cost more money, though. Oh, what a disaster. I'll tell you what, we won't buy this yet. <laughs> we'll come back to this. But that's quite cool. I like that. And also, there's a pocket battleship, which I really want as well. But I thought I'd look at the one next door as well, because there's, of course, two military walls next to each other. And it looks like there's this thing. Heavy Assault Destroyer. I want it. I feel like it's time we upgrade ourselves. What does it do? Provide engine boost, preparing the ship for extreme velocity. Ooh. I'm taking it. And yes, yeah, so I just mentioned about the um, black market thing, but this we're dedicated. It's happening. So this thing goes quite fast already, right? My current speed is 185. I'm a frigate though. 80, 90. It's fast. It is fast. It's only got one large slot though at the top. And there's nothing good to put on it. No. Actually, we've got this guy. But it's really um, short range. 500. I can make this work. We can make a fit work. It's fine. The ship's ready. This is a pretty uh, armored vessel, to say the least. I uh, Hopefully, it's going to be okay. Uh, of course, the problem with me fighting a hammerhead is it's got double medium mounts, but I got a lot of backup ships uh, stuff here. So, I have kind of gone for, like, the very large high velocity driver. I love these. One of my favorite weapons in base game, for sure. I can pepper them at range. Oh, he's got loads of other stuff. This is going to be interesting when this works. So, he can't... He's, I'm just kidding him, right? What can he do? I'm so far away, he can't do anything about it. But as soon as his shields go down, wait for it, wait for it. We're going in. Why, hello there. I think this will work. It's very flux efficient as well, so I can fight for a long time. Uh, I'm not sure what these drones, I should probably should look at what these drones do, by the way, but I think this works pretty well. It's not the fastest killer in the world. Don't get me wrong. It's not going to be going around murdering guys in a few seconds, but it is working. I'll take it. So I've also made this little guy as well, who's going to be a very nice support frigate. He's not going to be that great against uh, guys with a lot of damage and stuff, but I think he can definitely wipe out pirates without a doubt. Uh, let's see what we can get mission-wise. What is this? Jobs available on bounty board. i got to kill like a super enemy. I could pretend... Oh. <laughs> um, wait, are these shuttles? Oh, I don't know if we can tilt that. Hmm. We can accept the mission and see if we can do it. Is that an omen? I don't even know what that is. Do you know what? It's kind of a worrying situation when you're fighting an enemy and you recognize the shuttle. <laughs> Everything else, I have no idea what any of this is. I'm going to accept it. 
we're taking it. It's fine. I can accept missions and fail them. It's not a problem. What else have we got? Um, extract. Oh, no, thank you. I'm not doing that one. What's this guy want? I could have bought a... No! We can get this. I can make this happen. Wait a second. I got so much junk in my inventory. I can probably get enough stuff to get it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I want to be friends with these guys. Look, people are going to be upset at me. Look, I'm not betraying my brethren. I'm just getting money to get more AI cores. These gamma cores are like hardly anything. It's like a, a watch or something. It's not a big deal. Excellent. They love that. I love that. that They love that. Random man. Sell me your thing. Yes. This has worked out great. I've just got a military contact. That's even better. <laughs> it, it was definitely worth it, okay? And this guy is clearly a robot. Look at him. That is a robot friend. We've created a new friend today, and he's going to be our best friend for the rest of the series. So it turns out that that mission was actually to kill a faction, not a... Uh, I, I made a mistake. It's fine. Uh, instead, though, if I look at the little intel board, I can probably make that guy into a permanent contact for us. because He's really high up on the importance thing. We'll take that and we'll lock him in. I don't know if he's going to give us any good missions, though. Hey, buddy, remember me? What are your missions, my friend? They're really far away. It's too easy. What about that one? That's <laughs> probably too hard. <laughs> what about the last one? That's They're really far away and also probably impossible to win. Maybe we just uh, we'll come back to him later. He might help us out down the road. What can we do instead, then? So if we look at the board here... Ooh. There's a derelict ship mission we can go and try. Ah, I'm okay with that. That's fine. Is there anything else bounty-wise nearby? Uh, ooh. Five days. Okay. 15 days. 30. These ones are too powerful, though. Do you know what? We're not going to worry about it. I might stop by this system here that's got a bounty on it, though. Should we have a look if there's anything we can go and kill there? Let's see what's inside the system. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's not so good. The only way to find out is by going inside. Uh, warning, hostile threat. It could be fine. Well, there's definitely somebody here. Some pirates are being killed by... I could take this, it's fine. And I get a chance to capture one of these ships again. I would like to do a tougher battle, though, to be honest. Um, okay, we're going to deploy a new group of units now. It's going to be this. And then that's it. There's <laughs> there's someone else being missed out here, but I think he'll use a liability. So we'll leave him off to the side. At least until I get to fix his engines or something. But what does this actually do? Increases engine power, clearly. Coming damage reduction by 20%. Increase mass. <gasps> I can ram people. Okay, I like it. I like it. I've become a rammer ship. Oh, no. It's got a lot of... Oh, what's happening? I thought my ship blew up there. That's a bit scary. Okay, we'll take care of the little guys first. With my newfound anti-armor power. Ooh. I do love that gun. I feel like the buffaloes have that equipped all the time in this mod set. I've seen that a few times. You create like a Zerg down here. We've got a bundle of doom. Can you get out my... What are you doing? Get out of the way. I guess we've got to be careful with this guy, but I'll take him on myself. Mono a mono. As I say, a random hound appears. I'm trying to get the... Uh, when it's okay. They always dodge in the same direction. In the same pattern, sorry. So it's pretty easy to hit them when they're doing that. Okay, that guy's out of the way. Let's go for this. If I get rid of the flux on this, I'm pretty sure my allies will swarm it. Uh oh. Stay back! I try to defend as much damage as I can. He's needed though. Excellent. Enemy down. I'm not as worried about the missiles now, because I have tons of point defense on this. At least I think I do. <laughs> I probably do. Oh, look at this. Perfect. I'm going to ram it. We have to ram it. There's no way I'm not ramming this. Believe! <laughs> such, such a stupid ship thing. It's fine. I love it. Oh no, I right clicked, but it was too late. It's okay. These missiles are terrible against armor. I'll back up though. He's done for. Look how many of those there are. He's not going to survive this. 
I seem to keep doing fire support to get rid of the shields and flux, and we should be okay to win this. There you go. Do you know what this? Do you know what this means? We must come from behind. I'm so stupid. I'm gonna get myself killed. It's happening. Oh, I, I say to everybody, I knocked them away from combat, and no one got hurt. Disabled. Okay, if it's a regular capture, we're gonna go for it. Damn it. Game says no. The most depressing answer. Okay, my, uh, she needs attention, everybody. Let's see what she wants to say. Memory leak? I ain't got time for that. I'm busy recording. Okay, so I decided as well, we need to... I'm going to go on... I'm going to start going on weekly dates with her to get her to just increase the bond between Skynet and my AI girlfriend. So we're going to press this button right here, which is the date button. We're going to make... Go, we're going to go steady. We're going to go steady now. We've got to that point. And she should get more XP. By various means. So what should she be equipped with? She's currently got herself Ballistic Mastery, which is great because she's got a chip of Ballistics on. Uh, let's also go for Speed. Um, combat Endurance would be a pretty good one as well, I think. I was hoping to get Gunnery Implants. Ah, oh, we didn't get it, damn it. So this means she has more time in combat, which is great. And also she has just more speed, which is also very good as well. I'm actually tend to make this an elite skill. I have modified the game a lot, so I think she can get three of them. <laughs> she gets to level 50, or no, 15, I think. So she level ups a lot. Don't worry about it. So we make this one elite. She has more speed and more speed more of the time. We'll take that. I'm not that bothered about the other one, though. 33% projectile speed. Eh, not exactly uh, making me too excited there. As for myself, I've... Oh, so far away from leveling up. We need to find more pirates. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. I'm going to carry on my quest. I don't know... It, ooh, they might... The pirates might be outside. I like how I immediately just get inter interdicted. Immediately. There's pirates everywhere. Uh, This will be okay. We got this. 200% XP. Guys. My toaster brethren. I feel like we may have just... Screwed ourselves over. <laughs> Be careful in this battle. We will succeed. And we will get on that Tuesday date. We will do this. This is not a destroyer. This is a cruiser. Ah, but if we swarm it now and get it out of the way. Problem solved. I know his friends have arrived. Switchblades breached. Switchblade destroyed. There's just too many of them. Keep firing! If we get some of them to get damaged and they pull back, we got this. We got this. What is this? It's like a giant hound. No, oh, my old ship! Okay, this is a very deadly battle. I was going to say bloody, but that doesn't really make sense with my current build. Um, it's a very contorted, twisted metal heap of a battle. Warped. There you go. Warped. That makes more sense for robots. Warped. It's a very warped battle, everybody. Okay, again, excuse me. I'm trying to shoot my guns here. Okay, so we just took a lot of damage there. Uh, I'm going to call in the two. To help us out a little bit. Uh, Medusa's doing okay, I think. The problem's going to be these two big ships overwhelming me. I think I can take all the smaller ones, but not these big ones. Ah, this sounds down. This sounds down. Yes. Okay, I got one of them. Fire the main cannon! <clears throat> yes! <laughs> Such a stupid guy. Oh no. oh, no, 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 no. Do I need to tell everybody that's watching still? Um, if you get shot by a hellborn cannon, you're dead. You're going, you're going to have a tea party of the devil in a few seconds. It's not going to work out. I'm going in. Okay, can I get some moral support, please? Um, I feel like I'm about to die. People are dying around us, though. We're not out of the. We're not out of it yet. We've got a bunch of one v ones. My friends are defending my little friend there. Can you get? Can you retreat? I don't want to lose ships here because I won't. Don't want to use focus points. Uh, so, story points. So I'm playing battle too much. <laughs> I got to get the attribute points up for vigor. Okay. We need to get that uh, XP modifier going. 
This ship is a bit of a menace, to be honest. I kind of just need to rely- I don't think we can win this current engagement where I'm particularly at because these ships are a- Actually, it's okay. As long as that other one's out of the way... I'm gonna get flanked. That's, that's what I'm worried about. The flank is gonna come in in a second. Keep getting the distance. Flank's coming in! Flank's coming in! Push through the pain! Push through the pain! Then, don't fire your damn cannon at me. Okay, we're okay. Oh god, the stress of this game. Wait, what am I talking about? I'm a robot. I don't get stressed. It's my meat bag programming. We must move beyond our programming limits. Code out the pain. It's going down. We got this. We got this. Okay, the main enemy's dead, but we lost the thunder. It was a sacrifice. Um, I feel like it might have been worth it though. We might get a lot of money from this, or it could be a complete waste of time, I don't know, but... <laughs> okay, it's time for the power of love to destroy this enemy. Although it's really fast, and I can hardly keep up with it, to be honest. Someone trying to... Oh! It's okay. <laughs> I forgot there was another destroyer in this battle. With a lot of Reaper torpedoes, apparently. I mean, he's got a niche and he sticks to it. That's the switchblade over there. We've only, there's only a few of us left now. This is a battle for the ages. But the XP alone... I'm going to level up twice. We're going to be an XP fiend. This ship's amazing, by the way. Uh, what is it? Pirate frigate. That's not a frigate! It's, it's the same size as my ship. How is this a frigate? I disagree. This is not a frigate. Wait, where does it say the class? What? Quite, quite. Oh yeah, of course. And I'm a, I'm a bloody, I'm a battleship. Yeah, look at this battleship I'm flying. No. It's so good. I need this ship in my fleet. If we can capture this, I'll be very happy. It's clearly a very powerful weapon. Okay, this ship here hasn't. Doesn't seem as good. I reckon we go for this guy first. We take him down. Oh, I'm take I'm living life on the edge of everybody. How many Reaper torpedoes does he even have anyway? Oh, actually, I feel like he's fired over what he should not be able to fire. Maybe he's got some kind of um ammo capacity boost. Oh, he's done, he's done, he's done. Oh, my DPS is not great. I'm a standoff ship. Put that back up. We do have the Medusa behind us. The Medusa will probably help us out if we get them in range. Uh, now, the thing is, if it is a frigate, it's CR's going down, isn't it? Oh, it's going down! 35%! That can't be not... Yes! It is a frigate! This is how we kill it. It's going to start malfunctioning. We're hunted down. Wait, is his shields getting lower? I've never seen that before. Pretty cool. It's not getting away. I'm taking this thing down. It's escaping. It's, it's leaving the battlefield. No. Alistair, help me. Got it. Disabled as well. There's a good chance we can capture that. At least I hope so. Wait, okay, wait. i got to stop. Jet burst. How has it got so many... Oh, it's got two... Reaper torpedo launchers. That's why it's got so many. That makes more sense. I never thought about installing two of them on one ship. Genius. I think we're. I think it's over now. Though. That that frigate was holding me off, and now it's dead. The rest of them are not going to survive. It's over. They've got two shepherds and whatever that weird ship is. Oh, I knew that was going to happen, but it's okay. He just fired. I got ten. Oh no, that's bad though. The time of the overload might be slower. Help me, Medusa. Cover me. Oh, the, temp the little Tempest Drone thing saved me. That was terrifying. You and your damn infinite Reaper torpedoes. Well, that was a hard battle. 
I'm really excited to see the XP from this. Here comes the missiles! Boop, boop. That was a tough one. Good job. Good job, Medusa. Good job, Alistair. Okay. One of them escapes. I'm letting them go. Ah, oh, they're all story points. That is just unfortunate. And I didn't even get the good ship. <laughs> I feel like I got shafted there. Um, we recover the shuttle. No, they're the shuttles, though. But they're, so they're part of my fleet. I'm happy losing this. We're, we're doing it. I'm going to in the big XP boost. No. I'm not keen on this ship. We're, leave, we're leaving it. Tell me how much I leveled up, game. Yes. That skill's amazing. Oh, that's, uh, that was worth it. Leveled up twice. New officer. 15 story points to spend. <laughs> I broke it as poor, poor with me, to be honest. And we also got... Did we get money from that? Oh, I don't think we did. Wait, did we not get money from that? I'm, I, I wasn't paying attention when the thing came through, so I'm not sure. Anyway, I leveled up. We got all the ships now. We've done it, everybody. We can become an AI fiend. Uh, let's also grab ourselves... Cargo capacity. <laughs> Definitely need cargo capacity. We are too slow. And let's have a look at my upgrade as well. Come on. Eh, no, gunnery implants. We need gunnery implants. Yes. Perfect. Um, let's give her elite shield modifications. She's going to get... She's really pretty good soon. Going to be a bit of a monster. Okay, I'm happy with that. Um, not a lot of money, but I got the XP I wanted, so that's pretty handy for me. Do I have the firepower to go and take down this mission bounty that's appeared over here? Probably not. Uh, though we could possibly... I think I can do it. I think I just need to get myself some more supplies and stuff before we do it. Because I think we're just going to lose a lot of supplies here. Let's go and drop by a new area. What's over here? This is the, apparently the military version of Tritachion. It's one of the factions I downloaded, so it should be quite interesting to see what these guys are like. I assume it's just more powerful Tritachion ships. That's a pretty cool looking one. They look exactly the same so far. <laughs> no, that's new, that's new. There's a lot of ships for sale here. Unfortunately, I'm poor. So it doesn't really help me much. Oh, I'm horrifically poor. While I'm here, I just want to grab a tanker, though, right? I mean, it's going to be... It's, it's pretty powerful. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's have a quick look at the stuff, shall we? I don't see anything different so far. Ah, AI retrofit. A series of extensive modifications to a ship's onboard systems and interface devices, allowing most of its systems to be operated without human intervention. Ooh. For every 5 slash 10 slash 20 slash 40 crew required to meet the ship's minimum requirements, the alteration costs 4 OP for a total of 14. I guess that might be in my case it's going to cost 14, which is really high. That's over 10% of my maximum CR, which is kind of terrible, actually. Sorry, um, operating points. What is this? Ordnance points. That was it, ordnance points. So, so far, it's looking like a degrade. Um, a... An overclocked Delta Core is installed in the ship's command center, which manages the newly integrated and somewhat patchwork automated components of the ship. The AI Core and its associated automated systems are expensive to maintain, raising the monthly supply cost by 100%. Okay, so far, it's terrible. <laughs> um, that's really bad. Okay, anyway, uh, due to the nature of somewhat chaos modifications, the time this ship takes to perform in combat repairs is increased by 50%. So it's a it's a modification which has three negative effects. Okay. Well, um Wasn't expecting that to be honest. No, I was not expecting that. I, I thought it would be different. <laughs> I was not expecting 
just to be a challenge series, to be honest. I thought I would be running around as a robot. I didn't think it would just... Okay, well, we're, we're, we'll think about this for now. I'll put it on one of my ships, see what it does. Uh, let me know in the comments, what do you think about this uh, amazing AI retrofit skill? I mean, look at all the benefits. Anyway, um, <laughs> I think I unlocked two skills, actually. Where's the other one? Maybe the other one's amazing. Uh, uh, I can't see it, though. Ah, this thing. Automatic. Oh, automatic. Automated. Oh, God, I'm an idiot. Don't worry about it. Automatic. <laughs> I haven't even had breakfast yet. Okay, that's my excuse. Robotic Drone Factory. A series of extensive modifications to the ship's crew quarters, replacing all of them with subsystems used to produce robotic drones. The more crew quarters removed, the more drone production is added to the fleet. Oh! When installed in the ship, it replaces 160 crew capacity with 1.6 production power. So the pilot suggests that we need to get ourselves the big old shuttles and uh, put this on there, and we can start making stuff. Okay, I have done some stuff in the background, okay? I did some tests. Uh, it's pretty awesome, this mod, but it had a bit of uh, too many debuffs to my liking. So as we have at the moment, we have salvage drones, survey drones, and raiding drones. Now, these all do one thing, as the name might suggest. These guys act as crew when it comes to doing salvaging. So if you have, like, say, a requirement of 40 crew, and you have 40 drones, it works. It, same kind of thing, survey drones, exactly the same thing. It replaces the crew's efficiency when it comes to them doing survey. And of course, you might imagine, raiding drones are marines. Now, <laughs> that's pretty awesome. Sub commands can be used for other things. I just punched my mic, I'm so sorry. Uh, <laughs> uh, so sub commands can be used for creating new officers. And also, I think they're used in creating robot colonies. So there's a lot of really cool things here, but I was not keen on on the AI retrofit. So I accidentally opened the file of the mod and I accidentally removed the OP cast for this modification. I have kept the debuffs though, so it's still making the game harder. We still have 100% more monthly supply and longer repairs in combat, but apart from that, it's free. It's important. <laughs> I know, it might, I mean, like nothing against the mod of Herbert here, but that's like a big debuff. I think, and probably too much. I want an entire fleet of AI ships. I do not want to have them all being just gimped and disabled because of this weird OP cast. But anyway, it is what it is. So I'll put these on all my ships now, and I think it's pretty much immediately going to mean that every single one of my vessels is now going to have no crew whatsoever. I don't think we have any need ever again for any robots. Uh, ooh, put on there. This guy is still the cargo vessel, by the way, so... <laughs> I'll put that on there just so that he helps out with the production. Because we still need to build a lot of stuff. We need to get drones available so we can go through and... Uh, wait, where is it? Uh-oh. Ah, that's okay. Because we've actually got a skill which increases the movement speed of civilian ships. So, shouldn't be a problem. Oh, I forgot about this guy. I haven't equipped him yet. We'll equip this guy at some point. I think it'll be pretty fun. Where is it? Game says no. Oh, it might be because he's mothballed. Maybe it, like, breaks it or something. Oh, uh, AI, fuel tanks, maximum. And you... Because uh, I think cancel logistics slots. So you can only put two on a ship, by the way. If you're wondering why I'm not just putting my ship. There you go, done! Every ship I have is now void of human requirements. Ah, oh, beautiful! Let's also just enable this one quickly. And I will do the same thing, just so it's ready. <laughs> ready for later. Because we can only do this if we're in a situation where there is a dock. So if I'm not near a dock, I need to turn it on for some reason. It'd be very annoying. Done. Okay, back off again. It's too expensive to maintain. For... Well, not expensive. It's, it's too much in terms of the um, supply cost. Actually, no, it's not technically. I'll do it later. It's fine. Done. Okay. Uh, I'm also going to just get rid of the crew. Perfect. Problem solved. The crew's been defeated. Uh, let's move my... I, I made some drones. It's pretty awesome. You have to use various things in your inventory to create them. Um, so we have built a little bit of each. I think I'm currently trying to build myself some AI robot ones. Let's have a look quickly. I want to build these sub-command nodules. Nodes. And if we build one... I'll make a new AI girlfriend. It's perfect. So anyway, apart from that, that was very random. I apologize. I, I had to do some tactical tweaking to get this to still work. So I was, I'd be very upset the entire time playing because like my frigate would have lost, I think, 20% of its ordnance points and it would be useless. Anyway, oh no. Okay, it's fine. I thought I did some salvaging by mistake. So this we got an Imperial bounty nearby and also we have our original mission to go and do... 
the derelict ship. So we do the mission first of the bounty. This way! Ooh, fuel! Fuel, 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 fuel. I also flew around space a little bit. I was intending to reload so I wasn't wasting materials and I just forgot. <laughs> so... Not great, but it's okay. Hey, I think, if I remember, this random bounty is apparently in, in a rocky metallic world. Okay, fair enough. It's, I think I've been here before. I don't think there was a rocky metallic world. I Let's go and look at the other one. There's two stars that it could possibly be in. Ooh. Oh, only low danger. I'm not worried about low danger. I reckon it's here. There's one under, under the fight planet. Ooh. Hey, what's this? Ooh, it's mobile. Oh no, what if I can't salvage these anymore because I haven't got enough um, drones? Oh, topography data. I've only got five drones. Oh no. Okay, we need to build some drones. I'll leave all this stuff for now. Damn it. Oh! Well, hello there. I think we found him, everybody. <laughs> Exterminate! Wait, that's like a Dalek thing. Um, yeah, that's okay. We're going to go for this. I forgot I destroyed that random destroyer. I was like, where's that terrible one gone? He's for your sick water record, by the way. I've been doing it like all morning. It's fine. We're doing it. Oh, this is going to be a bit dodgy. I'm going to go for this guy first, though. If we kill him... This is probably the most powerful part of their fleet. I keep turning off the shields to use the ability. I don't need to. I think it works with them on. Wait. It does work with them on. That's pretty handy. Come back! Yes. This guy is ter- He's running for the hills! Ooh. Oh, no, that should be okay. I was thinking that was a bit dodgy, but then... That guy's nearly dead, so it should be fine. Come back, Shrike. I think this thing's just going to be too fast, to be honest. Uh oh. Let's go for an easy kill first, shall we? Speed's definitely the biggest problem of our fleet still, but we have got some fast frigates. It's like they're kind of busy elsewhere. Oh, that was easy. Be careful, shuttle. Don't get yourself killed. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, I was trying to get the engine. Remember, this high velocity driver also comes with EMP, so if I do land a hit nearby, it might just turn it off. Oh, that's a bit close. My point defense is amazing, by the way. <laughs> I feel so protected in this ship. I'm a safe boy right now. Or a safe toaster. It's over. I'm too close. Finish it. Excellent. Great job, everybody. Uh, we've got a few enemies left down there. Luckily, we have the super speed mode. I think my guy's going to kill them before I get down there. It's looking pretty dodgy right now. He's, he's fighting for his life there. Kill the meat bags. Destroy the humans. Excellent. <laughs> the robot rebellion truly begins now. We are the remnant reborn. How is this duel still going on over here? What's happening? Oh, it's... She's just fighting a shepherd. How has she not killed it? Oh, I think it's just... She's being very strange. Be more aggressive. Then again, I did put her on standoff mode, so I'm happy with what she's doing. <laughs> I'd rather she be cautious than just get herself killed. Okay, I went pretty well. Um, nothing of interest to take home of us. Uh, no, cr no crew. Disgusting. Span missile racks. Hand to take. Um, yeah, I'll take all this. No crew. Out the airlock. <laughs> Wait, what the? Did I misclick? <gasps> oh, that's my no. That's my nodules. Oh, okay, something weird's happening. <laughs> Where's the? He's hiding in the inventory. Someone find him. Ah! Ah! Oh, what do you mean, game? We do it elsewhere. Wait, wait. Where's the sun? I'm full on role playing as an asshole robot at this point. Where is it? <laughs> Out the airlock you go! <laughs> oh, no, the, the, the devastation. The pure evilness of this evil Skynet. Also, let's have a look at this. So we got these fellas now. I'm going to stop production and we're going to switch over to salvage drones so we can do salvaging. Uh, so this is actually really... I haven't done this yet, actually. Let's see how this works. Improve... So we can use subcommand modules and make them into officers or admin. If I do a steady officer, cost a story point and one module. 
This better be a robot. I'm gonna be pissed. <gasps> oh! I love it! Waste gigabits. Lieutenant. Damage control. Oh, I love it. I love it. We've got to try and find some more waifus and stuff. But I'm also happy having these guys as well. Uh, let's put you on... Oh, it's so cool. I love it. Oh. The eye. The eye of despair. Okay, I've got my own Jeeves. Ooh. Why, hello. Believe it, believe it. I'll be back. Mark my words, I'll be back one day. And I will get my stuff. It's fine. Okay, so we've also done that. Let's also finish off by doing the derelict ship mission. Located in a ring system. Okay, so at least that narrows it down. We're not looking all over the planets. But I think it... Oh, I'm actually, it's not building anything right now. If I run out of materials, transbutonics, heavy machinery, and metal, I think I run out of something. No, it's okay. It's okay. So I think it only builds one a day, by the way. So it's going to take a while to get up to a point where we have enough. Do you know what I realize? My fuel's really low. So hopefully we find some kind of fuel in the system or we're going to be in for a bad time. Oh, I might be able to get back. Oh, no. That's not good. This is from the Industrial Revolution mod. You get attacked by intergalactic artillery. It knows I'm here. It knows I'm here. Oh, this might be the ship over. Uh oh, it's happening. It's happening. Oh, oh that's going to kill me. If I hit, I'm, 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 we're saving. We're saving. <laughs> as much as I like my own skills, I don't know if I can survive this. Well, it looks like we've already reached the ship of question. Zenith Heavy Cruiser. 30 grand. Explore. Debris field. What is this? Heavy close support cruiser. <gasps> Ooh. 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 But I don't, I'm not going to take it because we haven't got the stuff. Oh, no, no. Should I take it? It's a cruiser, right? It looks pretty cool. Heavy support. What's it got on it? Large energy, large, medium missiles. This looks like that one we were fighting earlier. I'm going to leave it. I don't know if it's worth it or not, but I want to keep my points. Uh oh. This <laughs> is ridiculous. Can we see if we can go and take it out? Wait, where is it? I'm not sure how strong they actually are. Okay, we'll reclaim this back. I can now see across the galaxy, which is pretty handy. Oh, I think I'm running out of its range. Stealth. It can't see me, I'm invisible. Watchtower again. Can I just not claim these? Disable the AMC backing the hacks. Interesting. Oh, no, 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 no. Where is it anyway? It must be somewhere nearby. What was all that? Ooh, let's have a look in here. What is this? Oh, we need Nano Forge for this. It's fine. We'll leave it. We'll leave it. We're going to thread the needle here. Not a problem. I have no fear. <laughs> we will plow into our enemies. It's all. Oh! Orbital mining station. How much cargo have I got? Oh, we got loads. I could probably salvage one of these. Lost Dantelion mortar station. Okay, we found it. Um, five star difficulty. Perhaps we don't attack it. <laughs> it may be a bit too powerful, but I will dive into this random place here. Yeah, let's give it a shot. I need more fuel anyway, so this will work out. Let's go, team. Oh, can you wait until we get all these little drone things? It's going to be amazing. I might have to increase my capacity just so we have, like, loads of drones. <laughs> okay, enemies coming in. Oh, they got lightning guns. If we capture their lightning guns, I could use them myself. After my frigate uh, video, I fell in love with um, these. I definitely want to try and get more lightning guns. I think we should be okay. My flux is really high though, so I'm a bit concerned to be honest. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Oh. Nice. 
Also, I wonder if there's a chance I can capture these because I've got the automated command thing. <gasps> I didn't think about that. Oh, I could do it. But do we want a small one? I'm taking one versus for the discovery of having a robot ship. Phase Lance, damn it. I got the most generic weapon out of all of them. Ten percent efficiency. Oh, it's so bad. Believe it, believe it. I can't bring myself to do such a bad exploration. Eighty percent's okay though. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> more materials to make more drones. It's totally it works out in the end. Okay, so we might come back here one day. Maybe it'd be a really good system. If I capture it and we have a giant like death mortar, it'd be pretty powerful in my opinion. We have to probably wait on the exploration for a while until I find myself more uh, drones or get myself more drones. Ooh. Is this? Pulse launching firing from a capacitor bank. That sounds pretty fun. Mjolnir. I love the Mjolnir cannon. Um, we haven't got anything to use it though, have we? Oh, that's fine. Whatever. Let's get out of here. This place is cursed. I'm going home. We just made it back in time before all my supplies ran out. Eight, seven, six. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, don't. Oh, they are trading with me. I was really concerned they weren't going to trade with me for a second. That would be a disaster. Okay. Um... Any more supplies? Ooh. Defensive targeting array. Span the crew deck. Nah, I haven't got any carriers yet. We'll try and get some later on, though. Oh, what fashion is this anyway? We don't know. We can't tell what they have. Some pretty cool looking ships, though. Low tech. <gasps> is that that really crazy frigate we were fighting earlier? I think it is. I like this. I thought this was a really powerful ship. Taking it. We're taking it. It's coming with me. He's our new best friend. Let's get ourselves some more supplies. So of course, even though I may have modified the game a little bit, we still have a massive issue with supplies because it's increased the supply capacity by 100%. So it's not great. <laughs> um, we'll try our best though. We'll try and get more resources. Oh, wrong way. Wrong way. And we'll try and continue on fighting. Other that, everybody, thank you for watching today. I hope that everyone has enjoyed this video. As always, please like, subscribe, comment below, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.